welcome back everyone so today i will be sharing six amazing things that you can do with your usb flash drive now majority of the people have the usb flash drive that can be of different sizes and many of you might have a usb that you are not using anymore or you have an old usb with the low data storage so here i'm sharing six best reason that you can utilize your usb and turn into a super usb so without any delay let's quickly get started so the first thing that you can do with your pen drive or usb drive you can convert into a lock and unlock device now if you come to this website of predator it says if you use a key to block access to your home or your car why not to do the same for the computer predator turns any usb memory device into a key that block access to your computer now if you want that nobody can access to your computer and you only can access it with any kind of key then you can convert your usb drive into that key and whenever you will connect that usb to your computer it will be automatically unlocked and once you remove the usb the computer will be automatically locked now the best part is that there is not any kind of requirement so even if you have any kind of old usb with only one gigabyte of storage then also you can convert your usb into a predator usb now this is a very important and it's also recommended that you should have this feature this will be improving the security and keeping out all kind of unwanted people like hackers now the next thing that you can do with your usb drive that you can convert into a portable app and make it a portable app usb so if you come to their website it says fast flexible and free every pc feels like yours because what will happen once you convert any usb into a portable app you can use your favorite application and software without downloading and installing them your favorite is software everywhere so you just need to carry your usb with you and wherever you go you use any kind of computer just connect your usb and you can start using those application and software and it's absolutely free and safe to use so you should convert your uh, pen drive into portable app right now and now the next thing that i personally recommend people that if you have any kind of usb drive that you don't want to use then convert into a dock pen and data usb now we all have our important data document like passport or any kind of driving license or any other kind of data then you can keep a soft copy of all these document into a pen drive so no matter you are at your home place or you're traveling to any other destination then you can carry your important document with your own self not only this you can also store some kind of presentation so let's say if you want to give any kind of presentation then you can keep a soft copy of it and you can give the presentation anywhere you want you can also store some kind of resume so if you're looking for any kind of job then you can keep that resume into this pen drive and wherever you go you can easily have the access and you can share with anyone you want and now the next thing that you can do with your pen drive that you can convert into iron bootable usb now i've already created a video on this topic that how you can create a iron and how you can use it for different purposes like doing data recovery or resetting the windows password now if you're not aware about the iron usb let me give you a small brief like iron usb is a kind of portable operating system that give you tons of options for troubleshooting repairing doing data recovery resetting your windows password and it's always recommended that you have this kind of usb because many windows users have the problem like they have forgotten their password their data has been lost they have any kind of blue screen problem black screen problem or some kind of infection virus malware so this single usb can help you with all the problems and it's really recommended that you should have one iron usb with your own self so that you can fix all these kind of problem now another thing that you can do with your usb drive that you can convert into a tail usb which is a portable operating system that protect against the surveillance and the censorship so what will happen once you convert into a tail usb you will be having a usb with a plug and play operating system that you can connect to any computer even to your own computer you can browse any kind of website without leaving any kind of trace without leaving any kind of cookies and any other information so if you're concerned about your security or you travel a lot and you have to use the other people computer so instead of using their computer and leaving your trace you can plug your usb and start browsing without leaving any kind of information so that will be really hard for the people to guess what exactly you did on the computer 
and even you will be on a secure network of Tor browsers so no one would be able to access or hack your information and computer. Now the last thing that I recommend people that if you have a USB and you are not using for any of the purposes then at least create a system image recovery so that in future if anything goes wrong with your Windows 10 or 11 you should have a copy of it and you can restore your computer. And it's very easy to do. What you have to do, click on your Windows search, type control, click on control panel. Now here in the system and security, you have to look for backup and restore Windows 7. Now don't look over Windows 7. I don't know why they are leaving Windows 7 over here, but you have to click on backup and restore. Now here on the left hand side, it says create a system image. You have to click on it. Now it will be looking for the backup devices. So make sure that you have connected your pen drive. Now on a hard disk section, you have to click on the drop down and choose your pen drive or any kind of external hard disk where you want to clone your drive. Okay, so simply select it, then click on next. And then it says the following drive will be backed up C system. So you have to click on start backup. Now only thing what you have to keep in mind here that depending on the size of the C drive, you should have the same space on that particular USB or any kind of external hard drive. So if you have enough space on your USB or if you have any kind of external hard drive or any external storage, then you can use it for the system image recovery. Now, once you have created a backup in future, if anything goes wrong with the computer, then you can revert back to the same condition when you created the backup system image. So that's all guys. So today, hopefully you found all these reasons to create a USB into super USB useful. And if yes, let me know in the comment section that which one you like the most and make sure that you hit the like and subscribe to the channel and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.